I'm Dave Delgado. Welcome to KUAM Sports. Thanks for watching. Tonight on the show, we talk MMA with Baby Joe Timing Glow as he's set to take on Justin Wilcox in Bellator 103 in Kansas. This is a semifinal fight in Bellator's featherweight tournament. We spoke with Baby Joe over the phone, and here's what he had to say about the upcoming fight. Check it out. I know I just fought last, uh, last month, but the thing is, is that, uh, you know, my team kept me in shape and kept me focused to, uh, to regroup and uh, heal up and uh, keep on training. And, uh, you know, I'm excited. Actually, I feel way better than my first fight, which is, you know, that was just a month ago. So I never fought this close to a, to a fight right after uh, an event. So, you know, like I said, I'm feeling, I'm feeling hot. This is a pretty good matchup for you. You're fighting another guy that's pretty much a wrestler. Let's talk about that matchup and and how do you feel about your opponent in this upcoming fight? You know, I'm fighting Justin Wilcox. Uh, he's a great wrestler. You know, he's a veteran of uh, a, a big organization. So uh, you know, he's going to bring to the table a lot of experience. But you know, I'm more than ready to bring bring whatever I got to to this fight. Uh, you know, I want to destroy it. You know every uh, every uh, opportunity that they got against my opponent. So you know I want to shut down his uh, his wrestling game. I want to put more uh, offensive striking into my uh, game plan, and uh, you know bring that W back to Guam. You know and win this tournament uh, to the fullest. Let's take a look now at your 2013 IFL football playoff schedule. This Friday, the JFK Islanders will take on the GW Geckos at the GW Field at 7 p.m. On Saturday, the Ukudu Bulldogs will take on the Father Duaneus Friars at GW at 7 p.m. Southern High will also be taking the field on Saturday night. They will be facing the Simon Sanchez Sharks at the Ukudu Field at 7 p.m. Make sure to also check out KUAM.com for a complete list of this year's IFL football all-island selections.